Hello, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for Tuesday, April 17th. This is for all signs. Now, this energy is fluid, timing is fluid. So. You know, when it resonates, if it resonates, that's the way it goes. April 17th, 2018. Hmm. Do I stay or do I go? You know, there may be a sudden change of some sort. You suddenly decide to, to change something. That could certainly happen. It's about give and take. It's about receiving. It's about generosity. Getting what you deserve. You know, there could be, you could be dealing, or you, this could be you, I don't know. Somebody may be focused on their finances at this time more than anything. Maybe they feel like they've lost some money and they need to recover the money. Whatever's going on, we have this materialistic nature today where money is really on the mind. I need to recover my money or make more money or get more money. Um, maybe you've been giving out money too freely. <laughs> Something's happening on the, on the money front here. Oh yes, oh yes. I need to work harder for more money. I need to concentrate on my finances. So today is probably either figuring out how you're going to recover from a financial loss or you're trying to build your bank account. Something is going on. Maybe you want to make a big purchase. Um, it feels like someone is really concentrating on what do I need to do to increase the flow of my money. Holy camole. I don't ever say that word either. Money, 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 money. Money, 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 money. It's about money. It's about money. Okay. It is. I mean, come on now. So, anyhow, somebody's trying to get an increase. I'm looking for an increase here. Hopefully, I mean, maybe you're looking for a raise. Maybe you go ask for a raise or you are you finally get that tax refund or, you know, you're working extra hard in hopes of getting a bonus or getting recognized or something like that. Maybe, you know... Yeah, somebody is, is, is looking for some kind of finance, financial increase. I need more money. I need some more money for some reason. Somebody needs more money, and they're about to do whatever they got to do to get it. Because this can even signify illegal dealings along with this, okay? Somebody is about, they need, I need some money for this, well, who knows what reason. But we have the devil card here now. We're looking at Capricorn pretty prominently, but we also have Taurus and Virgo. Um, and this could resonate with any sign. I'm just telling you what I see here. Somebody has something that they want on the materialistic plane that they want. I want that. I have to have it. I need to have it. I got to have it. I, I mean, there's a, there is a obsession that is being dealt with or an addiction obsession or an addiction that needs to be fed and that is money's needed you know and addictions come in many forms i mean if you look at uh, keeping up with the joneses is an addiction okay i mean somebody has to come up with the funds Perhaps to look good. Hmm. 
you know, somebody is, there could be some sort of <laughs> breakdown, okay? There could be. Maybe you deserve more money. Maybe wherever you're at, they're not going to give you any more money. And you come to, up to come to the conclusion that if I'm a he worth a hell of a lot more than what you're paying me, and if you aren't going to give me more money, then I'm going to go find somebody that will appreciate me. That could be the case. For some of you, you are making progress in building up your finances, but you still have some work to do because you may be spending it on desires rather than actual true needs. You may be wasting money on stupid stuff and illegal things or obsessions or addictions or and rather than saving it, you know, so you have to con you're constantly in recovery mode, okay? I feel like there is some sort of disruption here in the finances that could be avoidable if someone would stop spending their money unwisely. Something like that. I feel like somebody's headed in the right direction. I mean, they are headed in the right direction, but then again... Somebody is squandering away money. So, I mean, there's, this is for hundreds and thousands of people. So, whatever. However it resonates with you. Either way, that tower card in the middle of the reading, that it's a, that's a disruption. That's a breakdown. That's a, that's a shake-up that forces a change. Okay? And this could be on the job front. You know, you could, you could end up being let go of a job because you don't work hard enough. Or you may decide to leave a job because they're not paying you enough. There could be some disruption in your financial flow. That's for damn sure. But I do feel, yeah, you guys could, some of you could be starting a new job or being forced to start a new job. Okay? I mean, that could certainly be the case. You know, I feel like whatever is happening here, there is a new path in front of you and someone is being called to have a take a leap of faith, okay? Maybe you have to just stand up for yourself, defend yourself in this situation. Maybe some of you aren't getting paid enough and you have to go in there and I know this is hard and say, hey, what's the story? I haven't had a raise in this long. What am I worth? Nobody could do my job. Whatever the case is, you're a hard worker. You deserve to be paid for what you do. You would deserve to be appreciated. Okay? So I feel like whatever is happening here, you know, somebody may have to stand up for themselves and take a risk. And ask for what they deserve. Okay, so, you know, however that resonates. Somebody is not feeling complete in a situation. This isn't serving me. This isn't what I'm looking for. This isn't what I want. And you can't, you know, whatever's happening here with this, the tower... In the world, they're both universal energies. They are. One is upright, one is reversed. There's, it's like somebody is trying to um, not let something end that needs to end. Okay, because this is a completion where it's time to start this new journey. Because this is the last card and this is the first card. You're being called to take a risk and, and start something new. But I feel like somebody is resisting it. But this one I consider, this tower is here, this universal card is here to say, no, 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 no. You really should. You really should start this this new chapter, this new journey. You really should because you're not getting what you deserve where you're at. So this could be in regards to career or even a relationship. However it applies, wherever you're at, you're not feeling complete. You're feeling a, empty. You're feeling unfulfilled. And, you know, it's time for you to do what's right for you and stand up for yourself and go for or ask for what you deserve. Yeah, wherever you're at, there's there's not there's not a lot of happiness. There's not. 
and it feels like somebody is sacrificing their time for no reason. It's funny because before I started this reading, before I even turned the camera on and I was getting my coffee or whatnot, I was thinking about all the time people waste. It's funny too that I was thinking, you know, we could die tomorrow. We could. There could be an earthquake. There could be a war. I mean, there could be. You know, there's a the stuff going on with Russia. You know, there's the, you never know what could happen. This is what I was thinking as I was making my coffee. And now it's playing out. You have to go for what you deserve. You have to ask. You have to do what you need to do for you. Because if you don't, nobody else is going to. And your time is limited here on earth. It is. It's, it's limited. So what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? You want to live in a spot or stay in a place where you're empty and there's no more growth and you don't want to be there, but you're there anywhere and it's ma anyway and it's making you... <coughs> it's making you upset. It's making you unhappy. You know, there's, there's a lot of... Uh, negativity wherever you're at and you're staying there anyway because you're refusing to step over a finish line you're refusing to bring success to your life because you're not taking any action but like I said it today could always be your last day so what the hell are you waiting for I feel like somebody is maybe you're being emotionally blackmailed by your boss or your partner or somebody to stay in a situation that is not really serving you. You could be involved in a toxic situation or somebody where you're, you're being controlled and manipulated. You are. And they're probably laughing in the background thinking you don't have the, you know, where are those two things? They're round and they look like this and they're hanging to do anything about it. So I feel as though you guys are sacrificing yourselves in a situation in that you're not getting what you deserve. And it's time for you to speak up, stand up for yourself, and fight for what you deserve. So I feel like today is a day of putting in the effort to communicate what you really want. I'm not going to worry about the cat. They play games with me. In and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. Anyway, I feel like this is a day of you need to stand up, you need to speak up, you need to ask for, you need to make a move. If you need to take a risk with that fool card. Empathy. Empathy. I'm sorry. Empathy. I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. Including your own. Some people only look, look at everybody else other than themselves. Remember to... Look inside of yourself. What is it that you want? And then look at the outside of the situation. Is the person that you're dealing with, are they controlling you? Are they being fair? What is their reality? Do they care? You know? Really look at all sides of the situation. Anyway, I feel like today is a day of standing up for yourself and, and going after what you deserve. Talk to you later.